Hello my good people and welcome. I hope you are doing great and uh, in this video I'd like to show you something small about uh, MS Excel. Uh, I normally see most of the young guys normally they normally do understand MS Excel. Sometimes hata ukiwafunza pale maybe pa computer packages. Unaona ni kitu ha hii ni kitu inapita. I'll never use this one. Ama maybe uko campus computer application or maybe you are in college computer application subject una assume tu ni kitu inapita wewe utatoka huku nje uanze kufanya coding and all that kutengeneza vitu kali kali hacking and so forth but i want to tell you that uh, ms excel is widely used i was checking on the archives i love nikapata haka system iliunda sometimes back 2018 even the password is 2018 I'll share it on the description. I just used simple MS Excel uh, formulas and nikatengenezea uh, mtu just a um, kind of uh, a small uh, system yenye inafanya kazi. Yeah. Then um, they, they ended up paying me ndio tulikuwa tumesikizana around 10000 lakini tu nikarushwa nikapata 7 nikasema tu juu nimepata 7 eh wacha tu dunia isonge <laughs> so eh uh, simple uh, fee, uh, fee school fees ka record to school fees ka system tu kadogo tu record school fees nika shule kalikuwa kanaanzishwa alafu they just wanted a simple system yenye watakuwa na keep track ya everything pole pole Yeah, and the principal too ndio atakuwa na keep your track and all that and because even secretary they can't afford kulipa secretary so now let me show you how it works it's just a simple system but before i do that i want to tell you that excel is very very powerful this kind of uh, just basic software as ms word like i showed you just page numbering and so forth uh, creating things like a uh, stamp Uh, doing what we refer to as table of content i did a video on that and even ms excel i would like to tell you like uh, almost 70% of most of the businesses here in kenya they normally use ms excel uh, even kra hata to file returns you normally know that you download an excel sheet which is um, has got a lot of inbuilt macros which automate some kind of stuff there So hata kama wenye mko campus mnaenda kutafuta uh, attachment kwa um, those kind of institution you will realize that um, they normally use MS Excel. So uh, let me show you. Uh ka system kaliko kana record una had classes in form of courses. I think let me use that font. Uh, in form of courses as you can see so na nika unaongezea courses hapa uh, you can say courses ama classes and the fees they wanna charge per term no no ama per year it depends on how they organize it wakitaka ku run per term or per year they'll decide which is which now Once they have that you will come to the registration they will register a new student like for example let me say i'm registering eric huh? let me autofill the pass, uh, admission number so admission number you just press control then press drag and it's going to display like that this data for classes inatoa hapa kwa this ni kwa hizi data iko hapa So ndio unatumia hapa kwa drop down menu. You pick let me pick like class 7 something like that. Uh, the fees automatically una autofill in a generate. Hapa pia una autofill the fees yenye amelipa unaona ni zero kwa sababu anajalipa chochote fee balance automatically. So once akikuja kutaka kulipa sasa ndio unakuja hapa una record um, Eric Chalo and you how to fill even the receipt number huh? receipt number like that so then you to fill this one oh, no you don't auto fill the, <laughs> the, the, the 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 
state the, the admission number you have to check the admission number the correct admission number so number three that is something you need to be cautious uh -huh. then here amount do not specify uh, I don't know how much then I charge seven thousand two hundred we would say that this guy here around 4300 and date equal date um, 04 um, 06 2019 somewhere there like it come by you so yeah no um okay could jump out of already shall reflect you are mainly pangapi and uh, how we normally link uh, worksheets together kind of using these formulas and so forth so we click on the use of formula some if formulas uh, mm, this kind of formulas v lookups and so forth so to print receipt una click up a receipt una kuja hapa unasema unataka receipt ya Eric Chiaro press enter automatically na display hapa jina admission number uh, amount yenye uh, receipt number uh, date yenye alilipa class ako class for amount paid total amount paid and even the balance inaonyesha hapo na unaweza kaa hata ka stamp hapa venye nilikuwa nakwambia then una click kwa print una print receipt is the print print is here so it's going to show like this now ume automate kazi utapoku una print nini utapoku unaenda ku print yo ama receipts huko si juu how much and all that uh -huh. ku keep records unaweza fanya data analysis hapa unaweza plot graphs ukitumia data yako unaweza filter unaweza sort yeah venye unataka na unapata mambo inaenda rahisi so you don't need to do your calculation using a calculator and so forth so as i told you hapo nilikula pesa kidogo hata kama si haikumalizwa yote so now um, i would like to, to show you something else about excel because uh, excel is something which is powerful as you can see kuna hii option ya developer option uh, i just want to show you the young guys when you are going point at least ujue. you can create an application using vb vba v that is a visual v visual basic application using SM, ms excel so kwanza kuweka haka ka menu unaenda hapa kwa file then you click on the options where it's options here and uh, hapa kwa customize ribbon utaona hapa kuna option ya check the developer ndio iweze kuwa checked ikikuwa checked now hapa utaweza kuiona so uki click developer alafu unaona vb hapa vb6 that is visual basic not not vb6 visual basic for application and you can add a form here uh, you can add a form uh, let's say let's say do let's do a simple program ya calculation to like uh, just uh, addition of two numbers something like that so una is attending a text box hapo unachukua ka text box ka number 1 uh, unachukua ka text box ka ingine ka number 2 uh -huh. and let's display the data hapa kwa label using a label uone uh, inafanana tuna vb Najua tu mimi nilishikwa VB ile masomo nilikuwa nasoma. Uh, nikifanya hii mtihani ya NEC. Hapo ndio niliamkia. Nikajua umuhimu wa masomo. So hata nyinyi nataka kwa kuambia you can do something about it. Yeah, usikuje uka No, this one let's remove the label. So hapa kwa caption ndio unatoanga label. Na remove like that alafu now we can code code utaweka hapa kwa command button even let's name the command button hapa kwa caption to it eh? compute you can say computer or calculate and um, now let's calculate so you double click hapa so now this one is text box one we will use text box one it's named like that we don't need to change you can remain with that name or you can give it your own name so text box one text box two see then this is label one so double click hapo uandike kama kawaida tunaanga dim naandika dim um, num1 let's say it's num1 comma num2 s integer because we are going to enter integers and we will say num1 is equals we get from the text box because we get number unatumia tu kama vb val function to get the value and you 
just write text box one dot text like that ni venye hao kanini kamevuka ndio maana unaona inaleta hivyo so we can copy sorry we can copy paste this one ndio tuende faster faster ni si quest ya time eh ndio unajua kuna wale watu wanasema ngo mali malizia tuende history I'm showing something yenye inaweza kusaidia ukienda pale kwa KRA unapata unaelewa vitu zile vitu zinafanywa haja hapo returns and so forth so uh, to display on the label you just write to label 1 dot caption caption and um, caption we will write what caption is equals we can write uh, something to do with um, num1 plus num2 something like that then to run the program you can press s5 for more when i click up and we can write like uh, 40 and 50 something like short and as you can see now your sharp from 90 so with this one you can do that say maybe we want to display like uh, this one let me say i would like to concatenate you know like kama inafanya kitambo nifanye so i can say this is total though so, sijad declare total let me declare total here as total total alafu here it will be quotation plus is it possible sidani my total just right total we don't want to use concur how many what is kumbuki total um there is a way that we normally write string something like that and we put this one inside if i'm not wrong nikishindo utaenda uta research peke yako ufanye research ujue kama inaweza work so i say 49 56 and like that inaonyesha total 85 something like that so yeah that's how you can create a simple stuff using this excel excel is very very powerful my friends so my young ones one day nita watengenezea a point of sale just using ms excel i'll just be creating a form using this feature alafu ina store data hapa so sitaji an external database natumia hizi worksheets na kitu inakuwa mzuri i'll show you one day how it can be done but uh, now kindly subscribe to this channel mm, unajua tu this is how you normally support this channel by subscribing sharing i hope you've learned something new and uh, i appreciate a lot for the guys who are continuing to share the links at least you motivate me a lot and uh, have a nice time see you on the next video